Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, I'll be showing you the new Blox Fruits update, Update 17 Part 2. If you haven't already, please like the video and subscribe. It's free to do so and really helps me out. Let's get straight into it. So in this update, they have added a new island right over here. And this island can go, uh, helps you get to the new max level of 2300 and with that there's all these different enemies like cookie crafters, cake guards, baking staff, head bakers and if I come in here there's something in here right this way this thing if you talk to them it says releasing next update so I don't know what this could be yet but, if we do come behind uh, one of these, might have to look around for a little. For some reason, I cannot quite find it. But anyway, what I was trying to find was behind one of these houses is a sick scientist. I need 500 Phoenix Mastery to unlock the phoenix raids which you can buy once every two hours for fragments only no fruits just fragments and then down in the middle here is the new raid boss eight more enemies it starts off with 500 enemies and then once we get to one i'm presuming it opens four three still three more Two more. One more. And a dimension has spawned. So, let's talk to this. Behind the house. Alright. We go behind the house. We walk into that. And whoa! Cake Prince right there. That is the new boss. So, let's go and destroy him. Whoa, he's got the Doe Trident. What the heck? Now this is pretty cool. Oh, he's got me in his mood. I cannot tell where he is right now. Oh my goodness. This is getting annoying with the soul person so let's try and defeat them I think we defeated the soul person what the heck this new boss is just going everywhere oh my goodness he's chasing me I can barely tell where he is. Where'd he go? Oh, he's right over there. Let's use some mamoon. Where is he? Not see anything without observation. Oh, and they buff and nerf a lot of different things this update as well. And I think he should be dead. And we got him. Oh, damn. I got Pale Scarf. Alright, let's reset and see what this pale scarf is. And he gave me three levels as well. Alright, so pale scarf. Ooh, that looks really good. Alright, so I will go check what it does. I will head over to the main island. The new cake prince can also drop his weapon, the sticky trident or dough trident. I do not know what it's called, 
All right, I am at floating turtle. All right, let's put on the accessory. Hey, there's new paintings. Cool. Talk to the nerd. What does it do? 15% more damage on blocks, fruit, or sword attacks, two extra observation dodges, and 10 times larger observation vision. That is crazy. That's like better than the... I'm speechless. That's even better than Blackbeard Cape. That's really good. Oh, I'm keeping this on. This new scarf looks pretty good. It'll look better on uh, the more blocky avatars though. But still, it looks very nice. Right, so I just equipped the pale scarf right now. Let's see how many dodges I have. 11 dodges. That is a lot. And 10 times observation range. I can see people at castle from here. And if I take it off, I can't. I, that's crazy. I can see them so far away. And 15% extra damage on blocks, fruit, and sword attacks. That's pretty crazy. I think this will be the next best accessory if you want to go bounty hunting or something along the lines of that. Say. Oh, and also, they've added this new compass thing, which shows you where your recommended quest is. And some things they have changed are pole. So if I use it now, leave spots on the ground for the first move, which is pretty cool. And I think this might be the only one, other one that's changed. The dark blade. Whoa, okay. It doesn't have the same aura as before, but this is the move. Ooh, that looks epic. That looks way better than before. I'm so glad they change this. Alright, so I'm back here at the isle main islands. Oh yeah, also some fruits got buffs like Flame V2, Light V2 and stuff like that. And also Soul for some reason. But that thing was also already broken. But if I use this quest thing, it says 13 meters that away. So we head that way. And there we go. Is that my thing? Guys, I just found something out right now. The Giant Islander quest gives you 645 million XP. That is so many levels right there. It will probably be patched really quickly, so you better get onto it. It might even be patched before this video comes out. I just killed it, and one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven levels, and that's without double XP. This is the new best way to get to max level. I just bought double XP. Let's see how much XP we get from one quest. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen levels. Oh, only in twenty minutes I got to max level. And look how much XP I have left over. Five hundred million out of one oh seven million. That's crazy. Just because of this glitch. Everyone's just doing it right now. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.